set identities or set relationships which can be used instead of drawing Venn diagrams. This video shows some examples of using such identities. Welcome to Mathematics of Engineering. The first example shows two finite sets, A and B, where the number of elements in A is 25. There are 32 elements in B, and the number of all elements in both sets is 39. We are to determine the number of elements common to both sets. First, we visualize the situation using circles. Set A has 25 elements. Set B has 32 elements. The problem states that there are only 39 elements in all. This is smaller than the two sets added together, as 25 plus 32 gives 57. This just means that the two sets are overlapping. When the two circles are joined, the intersection of A and B, which is the required, shows out. Using identities, we use one involving two finite sets, where it states the number of elements in the union of sets A and B is equal to the number of elements in set A plus the number of elements in set B less the number of elements in their intersection. Check out the given. We have the number of elements in set A as 25. In set B is 32. Then the total number of elements in both sets is 39. Simply plug these values in the identity so we get 39 is equal to 25 and 32 less n of the intersection of a and b. Transpose the other elements and isolate n of a, a intersection b as 25 plus 32 minus 39 to give 18. The second example states if the number of elements in the difference of A and B is 18, their union gives 70 elements, and their intersection yields 25 elements, how many elements are in set B? Seeing intersections and unions in the given, we can draw two overlapping circles and have them designated as sets A and B. Set A minus B has 18 elements and that can be written on this part of the diagram. The next given parameter is the elements in the union of A and B, which is 70. Then lastly, the elements in the intersection of sets A and B is 25. So using the total number of elements, we can determine N of set B minus A. Using an identity, we take n of the union of A and B as equal to the number of elements of A minus B plus the number of elements in their intersection plus the number of elements in B minus A. n of A minus B is 18, and the number of elements of the union is 70, with the intersection as 25. Place them all in the identity to have 70 as 18 plus 25 with n of b minus a. Transpose the constants to just one side and take the number of elements of b minus a as 27. Learning that the third part of the Venn diagram is 27, we can add all elements comprising set b, and that is 25 plus 27, which gives 52. Another example works on sets X and Y, where X has 17 elements, Y 23, and their union makes 38 elements. Determine the number of elements in their intersection. This example is similar with the first one, so draw the first circle of set X with 17 elements. 
then set y with 23. The union of sets x and y results to 38 elements, so there should be some elements in their overlap. Use the identity of union as equal to the number of elements in each set minus the number of elements of their intersection. The number of x is 17. Y has 23 elements, and both contain 38 elements. Place them all together in the identity, giving 38 as equal to 17 plus 23 minus n of x intersection y. Isolate the required to get 17 plus 23 minus 38, which can be simplified as 2. More examples in word problems are discussed in the next video. Thank mm -hmm. you.